front end. You can your back end. Okay. <laughs> so I've got a trans-abdominal uh, sector probe for the ultrasound, and I'm going to scan through their belly wall and see if there's any babies in there. Wow, what is that? That's actually a cross-section of the fetus. So this one is pregnant, and that is the baby. Oh. See how it looks like ribs? Oh, I do. See, oh my gosh, the baby's rib cage. That's the chest. Oh, look, and there's the heartbeat. Whoa. See, so this one's alive. It's got the heartbeat oh. in the middle of the chest. Like what these ultrasounds do is they send out sound waves. So you can see the real bright white is bone. The gray scale is like muscle and soft tissue. Wow. And then the black is either fluid or air. So you can totally see it. Let's just do one quick scan on the other side. I just want to see if she's got two. Okay. I know, as small as they are, they're sure yeah. hard to handle. Because pygmy goats are small, their pelvic inlet is small as well. They can have problems giving birth. Oh, well, she's got one on this side too, I think. That's a cross section of the heartbeat. Look at that, that was awesome. She's got one on each side, so. Yay, you're gonna have twins. Next. On with the next, all right, come on, Hina. Pygmy goats are very cute. God, you just want to just, just grab them and hug them every second. Oh, all right, all right. As long as Jenny doesn't mind a little bit of goat poop in her house. It's OK, it's a farmhouse. A little bit of goat poop here, a little bit of goat poop there. You're hairy. Oh, look at that, she's pregnant. Yay! Those are the what's called the cotyledons. The inside of the uterus is attached to the placenta by these circular donuts almost. So that's actually the attachment of the outside of the placenta to the inside of the uterus. Oh, you pregnant mama. You're so happy. 